Hey, what's going on guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to get free Steam games um, working as of September 2017. Now, um, this is something I feel like will never be, uh, I guess you could say patched, or it will never be like um, stopped. So, for, for a long time, I say this will work for you guys. So, um, many of you guys who have been around my channel for a while, you probably know about nosteam.oro. I've been doing all my free game videos on the website because, I mean, they're the only legit website I've seen so far that you don't need to um, um, text a number or you don't need to do a survey or you don't need to install games on your phone to get like Steam gift cards. It's fully legit and all you have to do is download the game and install it right onto your computer. Um, so I'm going to show you the website right now if you guys aren't um, familiar with it. nosteam.oro slash index.php. Come to this website here. I'll leave a link in the description. And... Um, yeah, what you want to do is pick out a game. Now, I've already picked out Titanfall 2, so I'm just going to show you some of the games here. Um, the new popular ones are usually at the bottom, so... Um, Prey, Tekken 7, Dishonored 2, Sniper Elite 4, FIFA 17, um, Titanfall 2, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands, uh, Life is Strange, um, F1 2017, Pro Evolution Soccer 2018, and Dishonored, The Death of the Outsider. So, um... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and install Titanfall 2, but I'll, I'll go and show you what it's like installing any game. It, it's all the same. Um, everything's pretty much the same. Um, you know, bar like, obviously, the individual game itself. So, the install process is the same, and how you actually get the game, or how you get the downloads, is the same too. I'm not sure where I've seen Titanfall 2. Okay, hold on. Um, oh yeah, Titanfall 2, here we go. So you go here, and you may get some pop-ups, but just exit out of them, they're all fine. And you want to click on the AdFly links here, um, and it will open up the uh, the download link on the deposit file website. Now, um, just wait and you skip the ad. I just see skip ad there. And click here to continue. Nope. Click here to continue, and here you go. So now, basically what you guys want to do is, you can only download one, if you're downloading the regular download, you can only download one file at a time. So what I recommend you guys do is, I recommend you go and download the, um, the biggest uh, file there is. So this will be the patch. The patch is usually the biggest file. Um, so you download the patch, this is 202 megabyte. You download this, click regular download. And unfortunately I've already done it. So you know when you have to download something, you have to wait like, I don't know how long, it's like 20 minutes maybe each time. And I already downloaded them for the video to make it shorter. Um, so you basically wait for the timer, like 60 seconds. And once the timer is gone, what you do is, um, yeah, you, you type in like the captures, it asks you to type in something like, um, for example, like um, Goat Can Sing or something. You type that in, you click enter, and it will allow you to download it. So, I would recommend you download the the, um, the biggest file there is, and then download the smaller one. Just, just, it would make things a lot simpler for you guys. So, now we can do is exit out of this, and I had the files here. You want to open them, and you'll also need um, uTorrent. I'll leave the link in the description for you guys uh, in the video. But yeah, you'll need a torrent. Okay, so what you guys want to do is, um, I'm just going to put it on the desktop, why not? Make it easier. Um, and it will open a Google Chrome, um, a Google Chrome um, tab, and you can exit out that. It'll open on my second screen so you guys can see it. But you close out of that really quickly, and here it is, a torrent um, itself. Now, I'm going to put it here on my, um, my other hard drive, and as you can see, it is... Um, it's yeah, 41 gigabyte. That's a, that's a lot of gigabytes. So, what we're gonna do is turn this bandwidth allocation high. It should download it faster, I think. Um, I do that in all my videos, you guys probably know. Um, but from here, what you wanna do is just download the file. Pretty easy. Now, depending on what game you have, it's, if it's a new game, the, it should download fast because it probably a lot of seeders um, downloading the game at the same time. But if it's a really old game, it might take a bit longer. But it should work. Um, I get a lot of questions, um, and a lot of people are asking me, is no Steam legit? And to prove it is legit, guys, at the end of the video, before we even launch the game, um, I will show you me opening uh, malware bytes and running um, running a, a scan to show you there is no virus on my computer. But um, yeah, this is just one of the, the, the best ways of getting free Steam games. And no, I don't really um, like doing all this. You know, I'm, I'm not a fan of torrent games. I don't torrent games, torrent games myself. I only do them for videos so you guys can see how to do them. Like, I actually don't have any torrented games on my computer. Um, you guys have probably seen Black Ops 3 in my videos, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 1, um, NW2. I have all the games, guys. I don't torrent them. Uh, not not there's like anything wrong with them. Not everyone can afford to get new games. So I just do it for the video, and you guys know how to do it. But um, I'm going to show you quickly. I don't have Titanfall 2. 
Um, not at all, it's not here. Nope, no tie-in file too. I'll even go to my profile, go to my games, and show you. See, no tie-in file too. Um, yeah, that's, that's the only way I can really prove it's legit. Um, okay, here we go, what the hell? That's weird. It opened on my, my uh, second screen. Um, but yeah, as you see guys, it's downloading right now. Um, it might take a while, so I'm, I'm gonna clip the video here for you guys, so I'll be back once it's done. Alright, so here we are guys, we're back, and the game is done downloading. So, um, quickly, I just want to say, before um, I actually started the video, and when we were on the website and no Steam, I actually forgot and realized Titanfall isn't a Steam game, um, it's actually an Origins game. So, basically this works for all Origins games and Steam games too, well, all that they've uploaded, so it's not like selected on just Steam games, you can get Origin games too, but um, I just want to let you guys know, I, I said Steam... Um, I said this with the Steam game earlier when it, it, it isn't, but it doesn't change anything. It still works for all games that are on the website. So um, now what we want to do is open this containing folder. And um, you can open the how to install on the readme first if you want to. But uh, I know how to do this, so I'm going to go to the application and click run. So that's all you want to do. Open the application and run it. And it should open pretty soon. Uh, not too long anyway, hopefully. Oh, it's already opened. Here we go. Um, I'm going to install it to the games folder, click install, and as you see here, it's installing, so um, it shouldn't take too long, it depends on your computer speed, I, I'm installing to an, an SSD, so it shouldn't take too long, but depending on whatever you guys are using, if your computer is good, it should be quite fast, and if not, then it might take a bit, bit, uh, a bit longer, but either way, it should work fine, so I'll uh, be back when it's done, guys. Okay, so um, it looks like it's done, and a bunch of uh, pop-ups actually came up that I'm going to have to quickly click away from. Um, okay, so here we are. Um, now we want to exit out of this here, and we should be just about done. All I have to do now is launch the patch. As you see here, we're going administrator. Yes and browse this PC you torrent Titanfall 2 install and there we go so now we'll install the patch you'll you actually yeah, really quickly cool um a lot of ads popping up now okay okay so now we can exit out of this here and Titanfall is successfully done so I'm so sorry for saying it was a Steam game to start the video um, you know, the process of installing is the exact same for Steam and Origins, it makes no difference at all. I just didn't realize I was downloading an Origin game, so. Um, either way, it's done now, and I'm going to show you uh, me opening Malwarebytes quickly, and, um, yep, and then we're going to we're gonna open uh, Malwarebytes, we're going to run a test, and we're going to show you that there's no viruses on my computer, so. This will take about two or three minutes, I'm not too sure. But, um, we'll let this run and see what happens, so, I'll be back. Okay, so the scan is just about done. Um, this should be the last part, and hopefully there's no viruses on my computer. Um, we'll see in a minute, though. Um, should be done now. Yeah, here we are. So, um, time to complete scan, 4 minutes and 13 seconds. Item scanned, 315,100 um, items scanned, and threats identify zero, so... So far, as you can tell, there shouldn't be any viruses on my computer, as you can see. Um, finish, and there we go. So, uh, now you can delete both of the files you downloaded. Um, delete, and we can launch Titanfall. So, hope you enjoy, and let me know what games you get down below in the comment section. Thank you.
Get more precision. Aim down the sights of your weapon. 